Hey guys, Victorian Garden here. Uh, so today I have a small update for you guys. It's just a really small resin update mostly. And I just wanted to show you a couple of pieces that I recently finished and a couple of pieces that I am in the process of finishing and just what I've been working on lately. So as you can see right here, uh, these are my love knuckles. So they have been domed on the front, and they're finished. And in the back, they have been domed also with a really pretty iridescent layer of resin. And then the, the little side hooks where you hang them have been reinforced so they're thicker now. And I drilled through them already so I can go ahead and hang this and it will be ready to sell. So I'll probably have that one photographed soon. And I don't know if you can see it in the light, but it's just really bright and pretty. But yeah, that's what that looks like. Okay, uh, so next up, I have this piece that I recently finished. And I just domed his eyes, basically, so the paint won't come off. I think he's super cute. And really, really sparkly. And then his backside is just yellow the bale and it looks kind of swirly which I think is cool so I don't know, he's really shiny too okay so these next pieces are just pieces that I'll be working on and I'll show you my favorite one first so here is this one this one is my Alice in Wonderland theme and it's really really glittery in the front it actually goes in the dark and it's got this keyhole and it has two little breads on either side and a little note that says eat me <laughs> so uh, the background just has like a warp hole looking effect it's got uh, just white and black rings going around and then the keyhole is black in the, in the middle but if you tilt it you can kind of see like the white on either side of it which I think is kind of cool because sideways of course you can st see through it and it's a little thick on the thick side just because the breads were kind of thick but I still like it so the back is unfinished I still have to dome it with resin and the front side has already been domed I just finished that today and I really really like this piece I don't know it's just super sparkly and I think it's really cute I thought of Andy Wonderland whenever I did this so if you're watching this you know shout out to you I hope you're doing good anyways um yeah I just as soon as I made this, I was like, hey, I bet Andy would like this. <laughs> but anyways, uh, I just, I really like it. And it's super shiny. I don't know if you can see it in the sun, but it's super shiny. Okay, so that's how that came out. Next favorite piece is this one right here. And it's got butterfly wings in it and a little tag that says wish. I had glazed these tags with Mod Podge because what I did was just get pieces of paper and then burn them down to the size I wanted them to get that kind of like burnt look. And then I wrote the word on it and then I Mod Podge them. But obviously I didn't Mod Podge it enough. <laughs> I was too impatient and it kind of leaked through but uh, I think I still like it so it's okay. And there was a teeny tiny hole right there and luckily it filled with resin whenever I domed this so all came out well and yes these are real butterfly wings no I'm not an animal abuser I just happened to find this butterfly and it was dead for a while I think it was missing one of its top wings because it only had one left so I'm guessing that's why <laughs> how it died um, but I found this and I had let it dry out for like two or three weeks and then I cut its wings off. I know that sounds really gruesome, but I totally said a prayer and said stuff before I did it because I felt so bad. But you know, I'm preserving its beauty. So it's it went to a nice place and then I just preserved its body or its wings. I didn't keep the body. Um, yeah, but you know, like I said, I totally said a prayer before I did anything to it. I know that sounds really lame, but that's just how I am. Uh, but I really, really love this piece. And this one isn't as thick as 
this Alice in Wonderland theme one. So it's not as heavy. And I just really like it. In the background I did this kind of like caramely tannish color. And that's how it looks. And that swirl is from the eyeshadow shimmers. So yeah. And this one is really sparkly and it glows in the dark as well. So shiny. Okay, so I really like that one. Once I stick a bail on it, uh, I will put it up in the store, hopefully. This next piece is just a pretzel that I made and put inside this. Oh, I'm so sorry, guys. I have the hiccups. Uh, it's just a pretzel I made and put inside of this clear heart, and it's got glitter in it, obviously. That's what the back looks like. This is the front. I domed it with resin. So it's nice and smooth and super shiny. And the pretzel is really textured. And I think the only bubbles I can see are teeny tiny there and teeny tiny over here. So I really like this one. And like the other ones, it's super sparkly too. And I think I'm just going to leave it clear. I don't know. I kind of like it clear. But yep, there's that one. It's pretty simple, but I thought it was kind of cute. This last one, I still have to finish up. It's just this heart, and it's been domed with resin on top, and it's super glittery, and it's like this really pale purple in the background, and it's got this uh, rose and vine heart inside of a heart. <laughs> so that's what that looks like. And I love the way this one is turning out. I still have to glaze the sides, because they're kind of dull. I still have to do that. And the back side I painted, so I have to dome it also. And this is how it looks in the sun. It's just really, really shiny. And super glittery and sparkly, and I really like this one. So I like all the ones that I did so far. <laughs> And like I said, you know, it was just a small update, so I hope you guys enjoyed everything. Uh, I also want to tell you that um, I will be having a 250 subscribers contest. And I believe I'm at 207 subscribers right now, so I still have a little ways to go. Uh, but I just want to remind you guys to tell all your friends, tell whoever else, if they haven't subscribed already, to do it so I can get started with the contest. I already have a theme in mind, but I don't want to tell you guys any more information about it until I have reached my goal number. <laughs> so, I'm um, sorry, but those are the rules. So, uh, like I said, just rate, comment, and subscribe. And I have a lot of prizes stored up already, and I really want to have, like, a first and second place. Maybe a third, but... I know for sure a first and second place. Uh, so if you have any questions or anything, just let me know. Rate, comment, subscribe, and I will talk to you guys later. Bye.